Hello Cancer, welcome to my channel Imrama. My name is Dipali. I'm a tarot card reader. Also, I'm a Reiki healer and a crystal healer. This reading is going to be for the coming month April and I'm going to cover all the four weeks separately. Um, also, in case you like my readings or resonate with my readings, please like my video guys. Uh, comment in the comment section. Let me know through the comments if you resonate with any of the points um, in my readings. It will motivate me a lot. It will help me grow. Subscribe to my channel, please. It will help me grow guys. Um, and you would be able to see more of my content that way. So yes, um, let's start with, the, with this reading. It's going to be a general reading. Okay. Cancer. Cancer, April. Seven of Swords, okay. So, um, Cancer, I can see some um, some kind of um, some kind of betrayal energy, okay. Um, so, someone has maybe in the recent past, someone has either betrayed you or um, or betrayed you, lied to you maybe stolen something for you or something of that sort has happened and you are you are very um, alert okay you are very alert probably because of this recent betrayal that has happened in your life let me pull out another card eight of pentacles okay so um okay so are you are you trying are you taking some kind of course or um um it could be as uh, small as microsoft excel um but uh, i think you're taking some kind of course here or you are in or maybe you are a teacher and you are teaching something to other people and you are charging money for it because you're earning money okay you're earning money and you, you are into into some kind of classes um something related to education maybe you are going for higher studies or some some six months course um but yes you're getting money also but you're getting money for it or you might get money for it later on because you are upgrading yourself you're sort of upgrading yourself and um, this has got something to do with creativity okay art something artistic you are getting into um, let me pull out another card for the first week april cancer so many cards oh. So my cards have a glossy finish okay and that is why they just keep on falling they do not have a matte finish but i love my cards i love my cards okay knight of swords okay so um knight of swords you are take, you are you are in a hurry for something you you are very i wouldn't say um, impulsive but you are ready to take action okay you are ready for something either something is coming in your life or maybe this person or this situation because of which you're feeling betrayed um or something got stolen from you i think you are ready to take action you are ready to to step out of that situation and to take some kind of action regarding that situation maybe just cut off that person or maybe take a legal action against someone but then I, i'm getting this feeling of some step 
like a huge step is being taken from your end okay like you are initiating something you are taking an action so uh, let's pull out cards for the second week april okay ace of pentacles wow so there is something something new is coming towards you which is going to get you money okay ace of pentacles you are going to get money you're going to get um, get success there is something a new beginning is going to be there so even though you've lost money even though you uh, were betray betrayed uh, by someone um, i think that is not um, affecting you that much because um, that happened in the past although you are not letting that person go you are you are um, not letting that person go as in you you are taking an action against that person you are not letting him um, escape from what he or she did to you okay and this new beginning is coming with money and success i want to pull out other cards now Ten of Swords, and I have another card that I want to pull out. Wheel of Fortune. Wow, wow. Okay, so we have Wheel of Fortune, and we have Ten of Swords. So I think there is um. Okay. So. Okay, so Wheel of Fortune is an obvious card. Okay, so some kind of luck and fortune and something very very um, good and lucky is coming towards you and it could be related to ace of pentacles it could be related to ace of pentacles which indicates this new job that is coming towards you or this new beginning which which could which would prove to be uh, very lucky or very fortunate for you um okay let me see where this ten of swords is is coming from so there is some kind of loss also happening so your reading is very mixed um cancer your reading is very mixed there is there was betrayal in the past but you are not letting that affect you but right now you have this energy of loss and this thing that you have defeated you have been defeated or maybe this is not you maybe this is not you this is an energy of the other person i think i think this 10 of swords is representing that whatever defeat or whatever loss um you had uh, you had experienced i think that is coming to an end i think that is coming to an end because uh, because there is wheel of fortune there is ace of pentacles there are so many good things are happening and those things are happening because all the bad things all the loss defeat betrayal theft all that is coming to an end okay let's pull out card for the third week now for april okay. okay 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 one second so we have 10 of pentacles so there is money coming in for sure cancer there is money coming in okay and uh, you are not you are not letting what happened in your past affect your present so there is 10 of pentacles coming which again means either if you're not a married person right now then you might get married um you could gain money through some kind of inheritance or some kind of wealth is coming towards you um and this is in the third week plus minus 2 3 days some kind of wealth is coming towards you this could be related to the wheel of fortune that is happening inheritance unknown source of money new beginning um some hobby or part time job related to art um yes also i'm i'm getting this feeling probably the action that you have taken against this person it could be a legal case and you are winning that legal case and you're getting money from that case yes but then every everything 
like all the happy things are happening here okay let's pull out another card for the third week oh wow okay one second one second so we have those star so those star okay so this card gives us um so there is hope you have you have still not lo lost hope okay so maybe this person who betrayed you he or she was a very close person and uh, because you are not letting that person get to your mind or to your heart and that is probably because you have still not lost hope you are still hopeful about your future that you might uh, you might meet someone new and you might um, you know like um, you are very hopeful when it comes to your future you have still not given up the hope and you are being properly guided okay one second the star you are being properly guided yes um so there was this eight of pentacles which which gave which was giving us this energy of um getting into something creative star is also giving us um a creative sort of an energy so um, either you're very are you a creative per person cancer i don't know but um like you're creating something maybe you are creating a new life like from scratch you're creating a new life for your own self because you're still not lost hope and you are being guided you are being guided continuously let's pull out cards for the fourth week lot of cards popped out but uh, i'm going to take these two cards and this third card as well three cards popped out but i know i don't know why but usually i don't take three cards when they fall out together um, because um, as i've already told you it's it it's like a mix of energy for me and i'm not able to read those cards but some but right now i'm getting this intuition that i should take up these cards okay so the first card is princess of pentacles okay so princess of pentacles is again financial opportunity money is coming towards you money is 10 of pentacles then eight of pentacles then eight of pen uh, then ace of pentacles then wheel of fortune you have money coming in cancer you have money coming in there is so much of money coming in princess of pentacles is again a financial opportunity coming towards you one second yes now the other card is the fool okay so here um, this card is trying to tell us that um, in in order to um, i think in order to experience all these lovely things all these beautiful things i forget to look into the camera so in order to to let these beautiful things begin i think you need to initiate okay you need to take that one step that one step could be anything getting in touch with your ex colleagues maybe they could give you this wonderful financial opportunity getting in touch with your with your inner self okay getting in touch with your therapist getting in touch with your parents i think you need to take that one like one initial baby step you need to take that risk this risk could be uh, related to this business that you are starting or this you 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 need to start taking risk okay without thinking what would happen in the future okay now the third card is temperance so temperance is giving us an energy of um uh okay okay so either you are um, reconciling with someone now um it does not necessarily mean that reconciliation with this with this person who has betrayed you uh, it could be reconciling with your um previous person or reconciling with with um 
with your with your previous self your previous self that was more confident i think you're reconciling with your previous self and you are healing you are healing right now yes so i think a lot of good financial opportunities are coming your way and you are not letting anything affect you and you are focused and you are calm and you are you are like you are just ready okay you are just ready to take action and just start the process okay you're ready to um to take the risk and you are healing yes let's pull out one card from the oracle deck for the guidance cancer align your life what is not aligned or needs to change so cancer i think um, um with this temperance card uh, i was already getting a feeling of reconciling with your previous self and going through this healing um energy slash journey i think you need to align yourself you need to change few things about your own self as well things that do not align with your with your bigger purpose okay things that do not align with uh, with um with your new self here because uh, you are changing okay you are changing and you need to get rid of those habits or people that do not serve your higher purpose so yes i think that is the guidance that we have and uh, yes it was an amazing reading uh, cancer that is all from my end let me know in case you resonated with my reading in case you did uh, please like my video share my video and um, let me know through the comments um, please comment in the comment section let me know um, if you resonated even with a single point it will motivate me a lot okay i will be very motivated and that will help me um, you know um, grow my channel please subscribe to my channel imrama that will help me grow guys that will help me grow so um yes that was it um please be kind stay happy and see you next time bye